Welcome back to my new video. This is Motion Designer and in today's video, we're going to learn how to do a planar tracking in After Effects so that we can replace this text easily with a new text with some animations. All right. So here I have the footage. We have to track this. But before doing that, let's go ahead and create a new composition 1920 by 500 and I'll call this text. All right, let's go ahead and create a text, which is this. Let's do some animation, basic animation. So position and I'm going to position it and negative 400, which is top. And so I'm going to animate this offset from a negative 100. Set a keyframe, go to three seconds and move it to 100 should be at maybe 40 and 60 select all these keyframes f9 for easy ease once you have the text here you want this to go down again so i'm going to duplicate this animator one Control d and first things first let's shift this keyframe there are a few things you have to change which is going to the advanced let's change this position from a negative 400 to uh, 400 and ramp down so that it goes like this right so that's a very simple and basic animation and hit u to bring up all the keyframes and control d to duplicate hit u to show up the keyframes and drag these keyframes and align it with this because after this you have the new text right so i'll change this to subway right so after this comes subway and I'm going to delete the last keyframe because we need to freeze that subway, right? So that's all for the text animation. Go back to the footage and let's go to effects and presets and let's search for Mocha, right? So Mocha AE, drag and drop it on the footage. There you have the Mocha AE. Click on this and that will bring up a new window and select this plus and make sure you check all this right and after selecting this tool you can draw a line on the plane that you want to track right so in my case i'm going to select this and right click to release this and perspective and i'm going to track using this button right so it will track all right, that's done. The tracking is done. As you can see, this stays right on the board there. And Control S to save it and close this out. Tracking data. And you can create a tracking data from here. Select the layer, hit OK. Let's duplicate this footage. Control D to duplicate. And I'm going to delete this mocha. Right click, time. And I'm going to freeze this frame. Right click and pre-compose this replacement right hit OK select the footage the main footage layer go inside mocha and make sure to select this layer and click this click this button and control s to save this close this out again and i'm going to select this create tracking data once again hit OK and corner pin support motion blur and select the layer replacement which is this precomp and apply so right now you can't see anything because this is just a you know freeze frame right and let's save this as a steel frame and we're gonna clone this out paint this out in photoshop right so and fx consoles copy to clipboard go to photoshop and paste this and we're gonna clone this out right so you can also use a content aware tool select this and edit what is it content aware fill and you can go and set this auto apply okay and select this layer back and i'm gonna do for all the text here so edit content aware fill and you can check here apply ok and i select this Control d to deselect and i'm going to select this once again edit and content aware fill auto uh, you can check here apply and ok so once you're done with this it's all removed you can go ahead and uh, save a psd and 
steal and save right so hit ok go back to after effects and let's import that steel inside here merge layers that's fine okay and drag and drop this inside right shut off the eye for this footage because we don't need it anymore and we're gonna drag and drop the text that we've created earlier and we're gonna place this somewhere here right so go to the effects and presets and type in corner pin distort corner pin and drag and drop it in the text and grab these points and align it to the corners here so that you have a perfect you know text you can just play with this perspective and align it perfectly right and I'm going to go and add a fill drag and drop it on the text and pick this color right so that it matches like this and we're gonna fix this issue as well so let's go and create a new solid rename it mask hit ok and and shut off the eye for this grab a pen tool selecting on the mask and I want to draw a mask around this line this line alright so after that you can turn it on and we're gonna we're, and we're gonna select the, the text and go to the track mat and select alpha mat and it will mask out like that very nicely all right okay so if you go back to the main footage right now you'll see this now you, all you have to do is select the still grab a pen tool and we're gonna cut this out because we need only we only need this right so if you go back to the footage now and if you play it back voila you see that all right that's all for today i hope you like this video and make sure you want to check these two videos as well this is motion designer and i will see you in my next video take care